It's so good to have you guys here. Let me say hello. And um, we're here on YouTube. I am just about to sneeze. Or am I? Woo! Things just never go the way <laughs> you have a flawless um, start to a live when you're live. <laughs> Anyway, Michelle is here with me. She's a little bit in the background. And, Hi, guys. And she is going to monitor our comments as soon as I get us up here. But um, Well, I'm going to try, Lynn. You're going to try, right? Yeah, getting used to this. And see if we can find us, hopefully. But um, I should have done this before, right? Let me see. Hi, Stephanie. Hi, Karen. Say hello to everyone. And... Um, Shirley actually just popped in for a visit as well. Hi. Which is kind of cool. <laughs> yeah, so welcome. I'm Lynn, and um, Lynn, and this is Ellen J. Goods. We're in the basement where we are trying desperately to clear out the basement of furniture projects that have been sitting around for far too long. So you can find us here on YouTube working on furniture-ish kinds of things. Every other Wednesday, we go live, and um, and you can uh, see us Mondays and Fridays here on YouTube and on Facebook. We'll be upstairs in the studio working on some projects. So welcome, thank you for coming. Please let us know that you're here. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. And Leave us a comment, give us those thumbs up, and cheer us on as we try to get to 15,000 <laughs> subscribers. <laughs> Hi, Laurie. Hi, Melody. So I am looking for, Megan's usually here doing this, and uh, current live stream. Hey, there we are. All right, I see Lori. Oh. Stephanie B2, Cheryl Mercedes here. Hi, Cheryl. <laughs> hey, Cheryl. To see you guys. It is Wednesday. It is every other. Or Hi, Mary Jo. Michelle calls it the fortnight, which I yeah. feel like, stop and think about, are we in the middle mid medieval ages or what? <laughs> Two weeks is a fortnight. <laughs> Aussie slang, right? I know. So, um, but here I'll let you... Okay. This will uh, kind of, you'll be able to follow along in comments there. Megan had to leave because poor Henry was not, he had to stay home from school today. So she's having to do the mom thing. And aren't we glad that she is able to do that? So um, Ellen J. Goose is located in Medina. Beautiful little historic community. And we are like smack between Buffalo and Rochester. And if you take, if you're in Canada... You can come right across like the Lewiston Bridge, the Peace Bridge, the Whirlpool Bridge. I mean, they're, they're all accessible to us within about 45 minutes, which is kind of cool. So we would love to have you visit the shop. And um, if you can't visit the shop, you are part of our people just being online. So um, let's talk about this table. This is one of those tables that... Um, Boy, I, I've got to say, I think we've had it here for, well, Ben and, when Ben and Rebecca got married, because we converted it into a tiered beverage, like it had all kinds of old oh, cut beautiful. glass and pressed glass, JR built a tiered top on it, but I mean, I love this table base so much, and, and right now, I can't even think of where it came from, but it's been sitting down here for a long, long time. And I just thought, um, I didn't want to give it up. I mean, how many times did JR want to throw it away? But but look at that base. It's such an interesting okay. shape. So he, I finally um, convinced him to put another top on it. It stabilized everything. And I think that today, if I can get us level here, um, we're going to paint the top of this, and I'm going to get started with it right now. This is Debbie's DIY. Um, oh, I have vintage linen. So you can use whatever whatever color you want, but we're going to paint this up. I have added a dark layer of fusion mineral paint underneath so that if I want to distress this back a little bit, I'll be able to. And then we're going to use um, La, La Campagne. La, Campania. 
La Campagna. La Campagna stamp from IOD. French. And we're going to just cover the top of this table. Hi, Linda Schluter. Hi, Linda. I hope I pronounced that correctly. We've got someone watching us while they're on their tractor, doing some tractor work. Get out of here. GT, GT Rink 1. No, with a digit 1, yeah. Wow. And Mer um, who's asking? Someone was asking us. Mary Casey. Let me Hello. turn the volume down on this. <laughs> Mary Casey's asking, did we have fun at the falls yesterday? We did indeed, didn't we? So I don't know where the volume is on this. <laughs> hmm. I don't know where the volume is. Oh, well. Um, did you have fun at the falls? It was, uh, it was something, right, to behold. Like, it's a lot because we drove all the way up. Uh, starting because I had the best guides in the, in the world because they're locals, <laughs> so I had the inside you had running. Who loves to give the tour? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so it was a planned tour. So we went followed all the all the uh, Niagara lakes or river. Well, we went up the Niagara River. Let me see if I can. Oh, there yeah. should be a place. To turn, it turn the volume down, and <laughs> why can't I find it? See, Megan's. I use. I'm never on this end here. I'll just turn the comments off. Well, we want to see the comments. Hold Thorough up, professional. Hold here. up, guys. Sorry. Oh well. Well, we're just going to have to do the best we can. I can I see guess. some comments through the screen, which is good. Um, but, yeah, fabulous. Lynn and I went on the um, mist. Made of the mist. Made of the mist. We did it. <laughs> we did it. We did it. We I... went right up to the falls, right up close and personal to the, like, the horseshoe. I've never done that yet. You haven't done Incredible. Either, oh, my God. It was, it was both scary and completely exhilarating at the same time. Oh, my gosh. Wasn't that something? You almost wanted to cry. It was so beautiful, so well, incredible. Well, I think you did. Probably. Because you said, I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like this. That was for real. <laughs> oh, it was bonkers. It was so cool. I'm, a, I'm applying this layer of paint, and I'm... You, I'm allowing this DIY paint to um, create some texture because it's so nice and thick. Can you message uh, Megan and ask I got, her how I to I got the, the comments back. And how, but ask her how to turn the volume down. Yeah. <laughs> on the, oh my goodness. The woman who can, I mean, we can build a website, we yep. can go live. Uh, three times a week and do all the things. Create a reel. She's going to find out from. There's those buttons up there, but I don't know. Are there be any buttons on them? <laughs> so we are getting some good texture here just using the paint, the thickness of the paint. Hi, Corrine. Hi, Corrine. But, um, it's Hi, Angela Thomas, Judy Gunlock. Hi, Hi, Judy. Hey, guys. Yeah, it's distracting here. Yeah. A little bit, yeah. But that's that's just the way it goes. I hope everybody's having a beautiful day. It is springtime. Finally, springtime here. Shirley's out for a drive for the first time. Um, right since yeah. your surgery. Oh yeah, yeah. So that's pretty cool. And you look well, Shirley. Thank you. Yeah, you look well she and healthy. She is dialed up. Yeah. I gotta tell you what. <laughs> look at so me here. Literally, I leave the house, drinking my coffee, eating a a, a protein bar. Um, Fifteen minutes before I go live, I quick throw on some makeup. <laughs> yeah. Ah, uh, she says it's on the side. <laughs> And Shirley literally has been recovering from surgery, and she's in a cute little dress. That one, maybe. Oh, she's adorable. 
No, that turns it on and okay. off. So we don't want that. Um, How do we get back? <laughs> Right. Sorry, you guys. I'll put left or right. Well, there's no other thing on the side. Hmm. Is it? Can I, um... There's only along that top bar there. Maybe there's can two I, buttons. Can I take a look? Maybe we can get it figured out. Well, Megan's saying the side button on the side, when you touch that, it turns it on and off. There's only these two. I think we found it. <laughs> That's all there is. Just that easy. Beautiful. Just that easy. So, um, anyway, uh, what were we saying? I don't even know, but... Oh, Linda, I said I pronounced your name right. That's <laughs> that's amazing. Schluter, Linda Schluter? Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So I am going to, uh, this has a lot of chippiness already on it, which I kind of want to preserve a little bit too. So I'm just brushing a little bit of my paint also over top of the existing paint. And I'll come back in later to wet distress and, and kind of make it all look um, the way that uh, I want it to. So we might just angle down yeah, a little yeah. bit to see what it is. Yeah, there we go. But you know, there's nothing better than a, a fresh coat of paint, right? And I'm just sort of slip slapping on here. Boy, have we been busy. We have we have been busy, haven't we? Mm -hmm. um, kind of doing all the things behind the scenes. Yep. Um, painting furniture like crazy. I love having uh, somebody here to help. <laughs> Production line. <laughs> it really is. Yeah. I, mean, I think we've got, my goodness, we've got so many things in the works right now and trying to mm. film all the different stages of all of it. So many beautiful things oh, coming gosh. up, guys. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's really exciting. So there we go. I think that's about all I'm going to do. You'll get the idea. The focus on this piece is definitely going to be that top. And we're going to have some fun laying that out. Oh, Betty, Shob's late. Oh, oh, Betty. Oh, once she again. Said, she said, but I'm eating lunch. <laughs> P.F. Chang's lettuce wraps. Oh, that mm. sounds yummy. That sounds yummy. I haven't eaten at P.F. Chang's in a long, many years. Many, Ex many years. Explain, please. It's, it's, a, it's a franchise, uh -huh. and it's, um, it is Asian American, I will say. Oh, nice. Salad, like? No, uh, you can get, uh, like, oh, lettuce wraps. You can mm. get, uh, sesame chicken. You can get, you know, all the traditional, uh, like, things that you... So when you wall. say <laughs> when you say a lettuce wrap, would that be like sang choy bao? Do you have that? So that's like a they do like a pork mince. The Chinese do right. do like a pork mince, and then you grab a lettuce cup, and you add a couple of spoons, yeah. and then you wrap it and eat it. Is yeah. that along those lines? Maybe, yeah, yeah maybe. So. Yeah. Or it's kind of like an egg roll mixture. Oh. Probably wrapped up in a lettuce wrap. Oh. I would bet. Okay. Tell me if I'm wrong. Um, mm. Girls? Or if you can explain it better, Betty. You're the one eating it, right? Yeah. <laughs> Tell us about your lettuce wrap, Betty, please. Yes. We food all know. wrapped in Food wrapped in lettuce, Stephanie B. <laughs> it's, it's just that okay. simple, right? Just that simple. Um, now, we all know that Thanks, Miss, Mary, Miss Mary Jo um, is no doubt having a delicious oh. apple. Tracy's late because she got distracted bottle feeding kitten babies. Oops, I'm, I'm, I'm making all these <laughs> motions. Right? Like, like, Michelle, you might want to step away a little bit from the camera. <laughs> because the mic is like right there. So just so you know. Oh my goodness. So thanks for that. <laughs> your head <laughs> um, yeah, so as I, as I was saying, Tracy's <laughs> bottle feeding kitten babies. What? What? Kitten baby. 
Uh, and Tracy says, I'm spot on about the lettuce wrap. Thanks. Yeah, well, we have um, the Chinese, Australian Chinese restaurants serve it as a dish and they call it Sang, S-A-N-G, Choi, C-H-O-I, I think, and Bao, B-O-W, and it's a dish. Yeah. Oh. Hmm. And what is in that dish? It's a... A ground pork mince, but flavoured in all the beautiful Chinese flavours. Oh, it's really fresh. With the lettuce, it's gorgeous. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. And how you would buy it or how they would serve it when you're in-house is the fresh lettuce cut that they pick out. Right. And then your dish of meat so you assemble it yourself oh yeah that's cool you assemble it fresh oh, that sounds really good yeah like a taco you'd make yeah. yourself yeah. i guess yeah. a little like a taco sure. so i'm not too loud lynn oh girls speaking i think you're okay now oh okay so the microphone is right near the it camera is, and you know i did yeah. it i didn't pull okay. my other mic for downstairs mm -hmm. so like I'm said, sorry, guys, if I was too loud. You're not too loud. Um, again, it's like... Oh, Melissa Jacobson, can't wait to meet you too. She had a cookie and a Diet Pepsi. That's okay. Who's that? We can relate. Mary Jo? No, Melissa Jacobson. Melissa, what kind of a lunch is that? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Mary. I am missing one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Stephanie says, so it's all about food today, right? It is, yes. Yeah, um, topic of the food. Topic of the day. <laughs> I love fillet of sole wrapped in baby bok choy with a soy sauce base. That sounds, that sounds good. And it sounds healthy. Yeah. Sounds nice. That sounds good. Doesn't it? So I don't know if you'll be able to come in soon, like closer to, with the camera, but I do want you to see that because I that there was paint underneath some parts of this, I love that I can get a crackled effect as I dry the DIY paint. Taking you for a little ride, guys. You see this? See how it crackled here? And that's because I have a latex based paint or acrylic based paint, and then I have put the DIY over it, which is a totally different type of a paint. And as it dries, obviously, this the paint underneath is kind of acting like a crackle medium. Can you see that? Yeah, it's a little bit of shadow, but it's not too bad. Oops, sorry, sorry guys. I just shook it a little bit. Oh god. They're used to it. Oh, they're used to it. <laughs> yeah. Used to it. It's always a wild ride here, isn't it? Always. Yeah, you wild would think ride. that today was our first rodeo, right? <laughs> yeah. No, we've, we've been doing this for years. We just we've, haven't We've come it to out. expect it. <laughs> I can say that from um, being a viewer. <laughs> <laughs> right, right, girl. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Michelle. <laughs> so there you go. If anybody is ever, if you ever feel nervous or anxious about going live, please don't. You can see. Just watch what we do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It is the most, we just do what we do. Mm. We just get in front of the camera. It. Yeah. We mess up. It's not perfect. We are not highly polished. You just get what you get. But what I hope you get out of it is the real deal and mm. ultimately a really nice finished project with an awesome technique. Mm. So there you go. Everyone's loving some crackle. We all love crackle, whatever yeah. way we can get it, right? Yeah.
So now you know the next thing that's going to happen. I'm going to I'm going to use this hair dryer for just 30 seconds too long, and gonna and off. it's going to shut off the lights. <laughs> This is where you all get to talk amongst yourselves in that chat. So what's coming next, Lynn? Pardon me? What's coming next? What's coming? Why are are they impatient? No, no, oh. that's just a question for me. <laughs> the stamps, the stamps. That's right. But I need I need my paint dry. Yeah. In order to do the stamp. Yeah. But it's almost there, you guys. Almost. Well, crackles, the crackles good because I think we even talked about that earlier with when you're planning it out. Yeah. So it's a bonus that um using my ID to crackle over the top or something. So we're definitely going for a very worn, rustic, old French country kind of vibe with this. Um, so I am not going to put in a second coat over this. I Maybe I should, but I kind of like that some of the, the, um, the grain of the wood is showing through. And I think that ultimately it's going to be fine because I'm going to have so much pattern on here. And then oh, yeah. when I wax it and do some distressing, it's, I think it's going to be really pretty. Really pretty. <laughs> Jamie Henricks says, I haven't had this much fun since watching paint dry. <laughs> Bada boom. Yeah. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> That's where we need Megan's um yeah. little <laughs> uh, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Almost there. Mic drop, yeah, right. Okay, so I reckon that'll kind of finish on its own. Let's take a look at these stamps because they're true beauty queens. They really are. And I just have not really, I haven't done much, I haven't really no. done anything with these. So today's my chance. And of course it was totally inspired by the IOD post on Instagram and I shared that with you yesterday. We have a dresser here and I'm like, what am I thinking? We, I am biting off way too much to try mm. to recreate that look because you know I want to. Mm. I want to recreate the look of that dresser. So, um, but we literally have like a dresser, a big bench. There's so many things happening yeah. right now. And I thought, no, 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 no. We'll just do a simple mm. table. How about that? So they did a twirl, a twirl layout oh, it's so beautiful. with using La Campagna at the stamp. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm just going to peel this back and take a good look at these and see how I want to lay these out. You really do have a lot of possibilities here. And Shirley would say, oh, I absolutely use that chicken. Mm-hmm. Right? And that rooster, yeah. Is this a rooster? This he, is a rooster. He's the business. Yes, he's the rooster. Okay. He's a beautiful Rudy. He's given the business. <laughs> so we're just, I'm just going to start to peel these off and begin to get a bit of a layout. Patty Hogan's asking what paint you're using today. I used Debbie's DIY. Um, this, white this. This White one. Um. The other one is vintage linen. vintage linen, uh, but I, you know, I, I just grabbed any white. I like this cow. Um, maybe I don't know. I really love the florals. Oh my gosh, they're so beautiful. So I'm gonna pull all of these, and 
What do we know about Toile? I don't think I want the grapes. I should have had the, a picture of their layout. <laughs> that it's a repeating pattern? It is a repeating pattern. Um, and it's usually old English scenery. Yeah, so should this be Roses? Like a, it's so rose this, Toile? Sure, but it's also French. Yeah, the word Toile is French. Yes. Okay. <laughs> It took someone from another country. <laughs> to point out the obvious, <laughs> to point that's out all right. The yeah, no, well, we're all, all here to learn off each other. It's good, but yeah. So you're going to use a rooster? So we're just going to, yeah, I guess. Don't forget to send your stamps, Mary Jo. I'm sh yeah, I'm not sure if she's used these before or not. These? Oh, Whether you're right, seasoned. Mary Jo. Good one, Mary Jo. Thank you. Thanks. I'll get some sandpaper. A little sanding block because I'm going to well, lay these out and then um, I'm going to... I'm the block. That... I don't like him just floating, so I want him sort of... Maybe. Um, so I'm going to use my thin mount. Hey, Cheryl, can you get, do you, can you get, um, um, Instagram on your phone? Uh, or can't you? I can. But I don't know how to do anything. Oh. Just to find Iron Orchid. I really want to look at the design that they laid out and flat out copy it. <laughs> oh, okay. I don't know how to get it. <laughs> okay. So we're going to do a search for IOD. There they are. Because I, I'm telling you, it's so beautiful the way they digitally laid that out. Oh my gosh, is that pretty? Yeah, it's very random. Very random. But they also used uh, the birds and bees stamp as yes. well. Which I've, I've done on a tabletop. Yeah, myself. Um, need it on the backing to sand it. Well, when I pick these up with my yeah. thin mount, that's what I'll do. Just pass them over and I'll give them a quick... What's that, huh? That's sharp. I like Isn't it. that pretty? Mm -hmm. It's so pretty. So we're just going to wing it, you guys. We're going to go for it and uh, at least get some of this. Oh, very nice, Betty. I'm sure it was really lovely. Um, Betty's just saying that Lexi did a tutorial last night using the, the rooster from... Did a oh, watercolor yes. one. Yeah, yeah. Mm. And Jeannie says, Toile de joie is always a scene usually telling a story, intricate and repetitive. Yes, I think that's, we've got that covered. Yes, thanks, Jeannie. That's what we said. So we want... The birds. Because, and so now what I'm thinking is, um, okay, I want to... Toile, yeah. While, when you say repeating pattern, and I know that of fabric as well, um, that I think what I want to do is begin to create a repeating pattern here. You'll so I can, I can lay this out and literally... Pick up your thin mount. Pick up the thin mount in, of in the pieces situ. that I'm using in situ. Yeah. You're welcome, Stephanie B. Too. She says this is such a nice break for me. Thanks again for doing this, Lena, oh, Lena Michelle. Oh, you're so welcome. That's nice. Okay, so I want to. Mm -mm, there's something about this space right here. I feel like maybe I need to bring him over. Feel free to, to chime, chime in, in and yeah, no. say, well, I'm like, 
Oh, yeah, I know. No, and I'm happy to have you do that. Seriously. You just need a bigger element at the top, don't you? Do you reckon? Well, I think it'll all, like, as I... I think I want to... Oh, you'll just repeat again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I just, just want to repeat. One. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, good. Mm -hmm. That'll work. That'll work good. You think? Yeah. Let's cool. get this. And you know what? I don't have to use every element. I don't have to use everything. Right? Yeah, but that'll work. Because you're doing a twelve, so you're repeating, and that's what it means. Yeah. I do like these two cows together. Really Should good. they be? <laughs> Should they be facing each other? I think they should be. Well, they can be back to back, whatever. Don't you think? Yeah. Well, since if you don't like it, paint over it. Well, that's true. Only paint. Mm -hmm. It's only paint. We have to cut ourselves some slack and oh. go for broke sometimes. Right? I'm really cutting myself some slack today. Yeah, I am. Yeah. Let's pop that in there. It's good and to that's... just play, right? Yeah. Without yeah. knowing how it's going to finish up. Yep. Yeah. You're right. So, okay. So now, I'm just going to begin to pick up... One section at a time. One little section at a time. And then I need a little sanding block. Yeah, if you... Here, if I'll you just want to do pass that right off. here. Oh. And then, I haven't got a block, sorry. That's okay. So piece. we're... Uh, the first time that you use the IOD stamp, thank you, Mary Jo, for <laughs> reminding yes. me or I just would have like gone for it. Um, you do want to condition the stamps by sanding lightly over the um, <laughs> the textured surface of the stamp. I'll try and zoom in a little bit, Stephanie. I'm not sure. We should be, if you do like this. Yeah, uh, it's just the angle too. So I want to yep. get it on the table and then perfect. you can go back over. I'll just do it a little bit. There we go. So I can see where you are in it. All right. Okay. So How's that, guys? Then I'm going to just double check here. I'm going to move this guy for just a minute. And what I want to do is, like, do this all in one part. And again, I'm just double checking to make sure that my pattern is laying out correctly. And Michelle's right. If it... If it doesn't look good to me, it's no throw some paint over it. Yeah. It's okay. Sometimes I'll get chalk and mark out when they're lying there like that. Right. I'll get some drawing chalk, pavement chalk, blackboard chalk. And mark where they're going to go. Off. Yeah. Just a few marks. Good idea. When I'm doing a multi pattern like that. That's a good idea. And I want placement because it's it rubs off. So sure. Um. So. I truly love using the IOD inks oh, in yeah. a chalk paint. Yeah. I don't know why, but it clean just... Clean and crisp. Clean, it's beautiful. Clean crisp, mm -hmm. absorbs right in and dries so quickly. However, if I were to put this mm. ink over um, my Fusion Mineral paint, because it has a built-in top coat, it's going to take forever to dry. And it smudges and... Yeah. We don't like it. So I lay this down. I stamp onto my stamp. Judy Gunlock thinks it's a little busy, the IOD one. She's just had a look at the image. Oh, sure. It is. But, but they are meant to be used in parts and pieces, right? So you can create your own designs and patterns. Yeah. You could always edit out. That's the beauty of them, Judy. They're so, um, with the, all of the Iron Orchid Designs products, they're so, you know, editable. If, you know, editable. Yeah, not, um, not as in edible, but I wouldn't want to eat them. But, um, <laughs> yeah, but easy to be edited and modified and customised to your own liking. So let's get this down. He's committed. I've committed. Hold it in place without shifting. 
beautiful. And it's let's gonna be gorgeous. rub over this. I hope it is. It might not be. I might have to paint over the whole doggone thing. We'll see. I should have brought a few thin mounts down. Yeah, Judy, it's a lovely stamp rose toile, isn't it? It's a classic. It's it's one to always sure, have in the arsenal. Some, you want a couple new ones? The toile is one of those timeless, ages old, timeless patterns. Okay, so I'm still going to hold it and I'm going to take a quick peek. I can see that I need to. Surely going to get some wipes. She went to get some. What do you need? Some more thin mounts. Oh. Oh wow, that's pretty. Oh my gosh, look at that. Oh, that's pretty. That's gonna be really pretty. Nice. Very pretty. I had a little bit of smudge there. My paint was still just a touch wet there. I think when it's all It'll done, it's going to be fine. Yeah. Yeah. That strawberry, I love that little Isn't that bunch. Beautiful? It's so beautiful. Little spray, isn't it, of strawberry? Okay, so I want. Can I have my hair dryer? I just want to make sure that this is dry under here. <laughs> Stephanie B2 just says, oh, a dust devil just rolled down my street. I'm sitting on the front porch and got dusted. Oh, where do you live, Stephanie? What's a dust devil? Um, Is that like a little mini it's tornado? Like a, yeah, yeah. They, uh, All right. Yeah, kind of like that. With that exact She says effect. I'm in the suburbs and with a laughing face. <laughs> really? And you have a dust mm. you have dust devils, huh? I'm sure yeah, Lynn will love reading that, Dorinda. That you she loves your project. She finds you very oh, inspiring. Well thank you. Thank you so much. I'm gonna use this. Are you going to have the, Mary? Mary's asking, are you going to have the animals facing in one direction or place them in different directions? Well, let's see what happens. Hmm. We're just going to kind of go for it, right? Remains to be seen, Mary. It remains to be seen. Stay tuned. <laughs> Stephanie said it's unusual indeed to have a dust, I was going to say dust bunny. Dust devil. <laughs> it's not unusual at my house. <laughs> to have a dust bunny. <laughs> Mine either. <laughs> so I have. Um, oh, like a little twister of Betty's shorts, saying eh? Of sorts, I guess. Oh, wow. Like a little twister of dirt. <laughs> So we had a nice treat after our adventures to Niagara Falls yesterday afternoon. Back on the subject of food again. <laughs> oh yes, it was so good, wasn't it? Oh my giddy aunt. It was beautiful. That was so good. Mm. We had a local um, local bakery, Half Baked Harvest. Mm -mm. which uh, I think I want to put this over here. Yeah. Just make it up as so you go. So I'll come around. back to that. Yeah. I'm going to come back to that. 
and then some ice cream and oh my goodness ice cream on that big fat cookie yeah mm. sounds yummy yeah so jr and i had the same thing more or less but different cookies i think you had chocolate lynn chocolate cookie i had a chocolate cookie with ice cream on it yeah and i had chocolate chip cookie with walnuts in it and a serve of soft serve it was beautiful and jr had was it chocolate with something else? he had double chocolate double chocolate and a serve of ice cream we had full bellies by the time we got back home isn't that the truth oh my goodness we sure did that was it for me for dinner yeah <laughs> But we'd kind of been, we'd done a lot of walking during the day mm -hmm. and up and down steps and <laughs> That's what I told myself. <laughs> and things like that. So we'd earned it. That's right. That's right. <laughs> it was like the, just the icing on the cake at the end of the day. Chance was virtually like standing up with his eyes closed. <laughs> He was really tired, wasn't he? was he? fighting it all the way, but, <laughs> but it was so funny. Yeah, he's so cute. Yeah, isn't he cute? So Betty Shaw saying, I live in Texas, north of Dallas. We see them in the planting fields once crops have been harvested and they till the soil. The dust kicks up and the wind twists it up. So little twisters in Texas. Be Always when you put fresh washing on the line, Betty. Yes. <laughs> right? Fresh sheets on the line. Yeah, probably. Yeah. I'm Megan today. Hi, Megan. <laughs> Your hair's gotten Which, so long. Yeah, I know. I might sound a little different. Megan's got a beautiful speaking voice. Oh, there's Bad dog. JR, everybody can hear you. <laughs> no. Come on here. Oh, I thought I was in trouble. You guys, I don't know. This may completely fail on me. I don't know. Why is that? No. I'm just not feeling very confident today. Hey, chicken, chicken. It's looking good, Lynn. Looking good. Hmm. What I don't it's have starting... is baby wipes, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Well, I don't have my baby wipes, so. Do you want a um, microfiber wrung out? Clean yeah. One? yeah. Yeah. That'll do in the meantime. It's starting to look like a twelve. Oh, good. Yeah, it is. I guess it's kind of a piece to the same as these pieces. Well, it's just creating that repeating pattern. It's pattern and repeat, yeah. That's why it's twelve, isn't it? So if that works for you. Is JR still down here? Mm -hmm. I'm here. What do you need? Baby wipes. Upstairs. Yes, thank you. And we have to remember, I like to fill it right in <laughs> also would be... Betty says, yes, maybe back in the day, but now we keep them inside in the electric dryers. Oh, <laughs> I love... I, we have Hills Hoists in Australia, so I don't know if you've ever seen pictures of those. They're a rotary clothesline. Was what did you call it? It's a Hills Hoist because Hills made them, the brand. Okay. So it's strung with wire on a on a pole and it rotates. It's a big crisscross frame. Okay. With rows of wire and they, you know, you wind it up to whatever height you want mm -hmm. and put your sheets and all your, all your laundry. I don't own a dryer. I've never owned a dryer in my life. And, um, the sun dries the clothing. You peg them on the line. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And the um, 
the sun on fresh linen is really lovely when oh, you put we, them on the oh, bed. Oh, yes. Oh, I love when you line dry. Yes, line drying yeah. is the best. Yeah. Oh, your grandma had some like that. Oh. I might be confused. What part of Australia am I from, Mary Casey? So I'm from um, the state of New South Wales, about four hours north of Sydney on the mid-north coast. So it's the mid-north coast region. Yeah, four hours north of Sydney. Yeah. Long way from home, right? See what I want to do? I do want to bring this kind of off. Tabletop's looking good, Stephanie says. And again, okay, so I'm I'm thinking of this as if it were a tablecloth being laid over over this table, and some of it is some of the pattern is going to fall off the edge. So I'm not trying to center everything. So you know, yes, my my rooster legs are cut off here. I have part of the floral cut off here. But if you think about it, um, it unless you wanted a very symmetrical look, yeah, that's great. Um, you, I like to imagine the piece as if it was being captured in a, in a photograph and you can't see everything. Or like I was just thinking with this, that if it were a tablecloth, you wouldn't see the entire pattern. It wouldn't be centered on the table. Mm. Does that make sense, guys? Mm. Does it? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Patty Hogan says there's nothing better than crawling in bed with fresh oh, lime-dried so sheets. So yeah. true. Yeah. So, um... Well, thanks, Stephanie. I don't know. I love your American accent. <laughs> so now and it's, oh, I've got so many things going on here um, just to hop across the pond eh? says Betty <laughs> to where I live <laughs> if only so I am just going to begin to fill in, Piece in. maybe a few little pieces here I love that bird there. I should have turned that one around. But it's okay. No. It's okay. Where are you going to do your next, think about your next pair of cows? Where are you going to pop them? Um, I think they're going to have to go yeah. over here. All right, well, there you yeah. go. Because you got your next move then. What you know. I think. Where you're going. <laughs> yeah. It's all right. Half a dozen pairs of eyes is better than two. Mm -hmm. Okay, so so if this ends up being the repeat, like I can put that up there. Yeah. Maybe do this instead. You right. Know, if you've got enough room, yeah. if you've got enough space. Do we want those birds in there? Maybe we don't even want them. Thank you, Michelle. Well, I don't know. No, that, that makes like sense. That? Yeah, that makes sense. All right. It does. Mm -hmm. And then maybe... And then you don't like you. I know you're not a fan <laughs> of having the whole image. You like right, things right. trailing off because right, it's just I do. a better resolve. Mm -hmm. It looks better. Um, 
And that's something we've all, anyone that's watched you for a while, quite a long time, certainly would have picked up from you. That's something we've all learned from you, which has been great. Go off the edge, yes. Yes. Okay. Whoops. It's helped me in my designs. Does it really? It does. I, little things like that really ring true. You know, stay in your mind. So, it's nice. The other cool thing about using DIY paint is that if you get a little bit of a an ink spot, you can just easily um, wipe it away. Yeah. Of course, wouldn't this be the time when it's like, oh, I wish I had six of these stamps all open. And I could just lay my pattern out and not have to think about this too hard. So this is Basement Chronicles well, today? we've kind of oh, stopped, we've moved on. Yeah, we've stopped calling it that so okay. much and just kind of working on bigger projects. Um, Furniture Wednesday, bigger product yeah. Wednesdays. Right. Yes, yeah, you can tell when she's in the zone, Betty, that's right. One thing that I always have to keep in mind is that um, I am going to be aging and distressing this quite a bit. And believe it or not, I talk about, you know, you don't have to be perfect and blah, blah, blah. But it's a struggle sometimes for me to make it look perfectly imperfect. The struggle is real. It most certainly is. Um, can you guys see a pattern emerging? I can. I can see a twill emerging. Okay, so my next move will be... I have to, Figure out my next move here. Will be da, 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 da. looking for my. So you want three roosters on the piece in total? Odd numbers. Maybe. We might. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm trying to think of what piece goes right here. So. So that might be like up there. Yep. Okay, we'll lay that down. You've got rose bunch beside. Mm -hmm. I'm going to need yeah, um, Wait a second. Why do I feel all mixed up right now? I don't know. <laughs> do we need to make a repeating pattern? Well, that was <laughs> the, that's the definition of a twelve. All right. <laughs> you wanted to do the twelve. I know. But it will kind of look that but way. It, will, it, will, it yeah. won't matter. Yeah. Just stop we're calling just, it a 12. We're just going to go it's for just it. A you know yeah. what? I am just going to lay this down and we're yeah. going to go for it. Yeah, get that monkey off your back. That's right. And it's going to be fine. Yeah. It's going to be just There's fine. enough pieces to choose from. Right. Goodness knows. Yeah. To create a design mm -hmm. that's be, all going to be beautiful. And they're all part of the one collection. Thing. You know, had I planned this out... I would have laid it all out, photographed it, and just really laid out my stamps. But we're just winging it. Sometimes winging it. Haven't had that luxury of time, really. I haven't. No. no. And so that's what you do. And you, yeah. you know something, 
and you just trust your gut, I think. You just have to trust your gut sometimes. And know that in the end, it's going to be fine. You need a lot, another bird on the left side, Pat, Patty Hogan says. We're going to add, we're we're adding, add another bird We're fixing there. that up right now, Patty. And we're going to add some bees and... And it is looking amazing, Betty, yeah. Yeah, get that rooster off my back. That's it. Chicken. Stop giving you the business. I know. <laughs> Just watch that stand there when you step, mm -hmm. step back. Watch your tripod when you mm -hmm. move back. Oh, it's it's looking lovely. Gorgeous. I know we need some of that in there. Oh. You can handle it. The big big can I? <laughs> can I? It, it can handle it. Can you? <laughs> I know, right? Can you handle it? You can't handle the truth. <laughs> yeah, that's it. And I do love for you guys to see how I just process Think through it, through. you know, and and on the fly. Really on the fly. Mm. Is it a true repeating pattern? Absolutely not. But is it okay? It sure is. It's beautiful. All the elements in that stamp are gorgeous. I mean, imagine just sitting on the veranda with your cup of tea or coffee or whatever and just a nice magazine, just looking at... They're so detailed, the images. You don't even need a magazine. Really sit there are. and gaze at the images. Yeah. Yeah, the detail is mm. beautiful. Mm -hmm. I think we'll pop another bird in here. Well, we need this for the floor up here. That's what we need. That's what we need. Um, I want this one, wherever that one is. Up here behind you, these limbs. Yep. Okay. The best laid plans, you guys. <laughs> it's always with stamps, so you do need a good size area <laughs> to lay it out. It's hard in a tight space. Mm -mm. Yeah, I think I'm just going to end up laying this out randomly. I really do think so. Yeah. I'd like to have another set of cows here. Yeah. And maybe get rid of him. Yeah. I agree. Would that make sense? I think the... Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. And just repeat what you've got on there. It's like there's enough pattern, isn't there, do you mm -hmm. think? Enough elements. And just continue. You can do another strawberry. I'm, I'm going to add yeah. lots more strawberries. So cute. Have you still got a top up of that paint there? I do. And a brush. Yeah. I sure do. Good Hey, to showing you how to fix up something when you change your mind on the fly. Mm -hmm. It's as easy as that, guys. Really and don't is. be afraid to don't be afraid to try something different and new. And that is how we fix it. Mm. And it'll all be okay. It will all be okay. I 
I tell myself? Don't keep going. <laughs> what to ask? Stop doing that. I know, right? <laughs> and you're pushing, you're pushing I'm fake. Pushing I feel like, luck. yeah. <laughs> it will be okay luck. until then. It's not. Until it's not. Until I it's know. Not. <laughs> I hear Megan sometimes go when I'm at home watching, go, Mom. I know, that's enough. That's enough. <laughs> Don't do it. Don't do yeah. it. Oh, and then it's, oh, I shouldn't have done it. Yeah. <laughs> and I'll show so you now I've how got, to fix it. I've got the experience or the advantage of having already watched for years at home. Oh. I don't know if she's lying. <laughs> Just have to try. Just have to push the envelope. But honestly, oh Betty, I hope it goes well. Betty's got a virtual um, consultation. Yeah, about Betty. it with a kidney doc, a kidney doctor. Oh, Betty no, Shaw. Betty. In thirty minutes, need to go comb her hair, so I look this big. Yeah. Okay, thanks for joining us, thanks Betty. Thanks for joining us, Betty. Just, yeah, you have a blessed day too. We've got 59 people watching. What's that? We've got 59 people watching. That's so nice. The little, the little chalk, is that what you mean? The what? The little chalk. Chalk? Chalk. Chicken. Oh, no, we've got a chicken, a chicken. What bird? Do we have this Oh, one? the bird. Is that from another stand? Mm -hmm. It is. That's a kitty What time is it? You've, uh, you've been on for, uh... One hour ago. One hour, okay. I think. Yep, we'll get finished up here. If I could just get... Started one hour ago. Yeah. If I could just get the rest of the stamps on yeah. here so we have a good Yeah, and I'll do an visual. overview with the camera. I think Hopefully. what I want to do is I want to get these cows on here again. Yeah. Maybe, yeah. Like this? Yeah, over. Yep. But the pair, but yes, offset the pair, so they're not mirror. To exactly. Be, to exact. Because otherwise, they're gonna mess with you. Is that what I'm thinking? Even if we put Just, him coming in like that, yeah. so he's offset from that. Yeah. Do we think? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And the other one? One side or the other. It won't matter. Yeah. Oh, no. I've lost me other. <laughs> it's not on the floor. Oh, he's got to be here somewhere. He's right there. No. Oh, my goodness. Did anybody see where I put my... Usually, these guys know exactly where my stuff is. Here. Can you find it? Oh, there it is. Okay. Beautiful. Thank you. So much for this beautiful manicure. <laughs> oh, yeah, no gloves. No gloves with the IOD ink. <laughs> I did not. Mm. Shame on me. Okay. I've probably got it online now. anybody have any special plans for Mother's Day? Do you do anything special? Those of you that honor the occasion. Yeah, put it where it mm -hmm. works for you. 
She's saying, whatever works for you, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah. Yeah, no, yeah. <laughs> Well, this I can say for sure, you guys. I'm glad I don't design. Toile de jeu. Toile de jeu. Mm. Toile de... <laughs> wow. I'm sure they do it all digitally now. Right? Oh, this wallpaper for that kind of thing. That's right. I'm thinking, why didn't I just put a, an and inlay on where, here? <laughs> that's where... um. And fabrics, that's where you mainly see twelve. Mm, um, it's already done for you. You're not mm. hand stamping it. You guys are so wonderfully patient with me. You really are. Dust devils are the order of the day because GT GT Rink one just drove through a dust devil on in a tractor. <laughs> Laugh out loud. Oh, and you asked about with Mother's Day plans. Mm -hmm. um, Vicky Dunn has said I live in SC. But we are going to Austin, Texas to visit my oldest son this weekend. Nice. Have a lovely time, Vicky. And Jeannie Henrik says, this is inspiring me so much, Lynn. Is it, Jeannie? Thank you, because I am truly right now feeling very um, um, unsure about myself with this whole thing. <laughs> I really mm. am. And I know that once... It's coming together beautiful. I think, I know that once it comes together, it's going to be okay. And for me too, very often, like, I'll put this aside, then mm. I'll walk away from it, and tomorrow I'll come in, and it will look mm. so much better to me. We need to... Little, some strawberries. We need strawberries. strawberries. Mm. You could always put the smaller chicken in the strawberries. Do you know how you've got the smaller chicken? Well, mm -hmm. the smaller chicken going anywhere as well. Well, I've got the chicken. Oh, chicken. you've already. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we're we're again Strawberry. we're just gonna wing it. Yeah. Michelle, that's what we do. Oh, yeah. And there's, there's before there's this flower. Oh, there's mother hen. Mother hen with tiny little chicks, aren't they so sweet? Mm -hmm. But I'm afraid they so would get much. lost in this whole pattern. Yeah. That you wouldn't see them, you yeah. know? Being a double stamp, there's so much in it. Oh, look at that beautiful. Yeah. Corinne says, Green DJM. Lynn, it's truly beautiful. Please don't doubt yourself. Oh. Sometimes things turn out better when there is doubt driving the creativity. I know all about that, Corinne. I Let know. Me tell you. I know. I, I hear what you're saying. But I can tell you that I struggle with I struggle with the same things that you all do. Mm. We all do as creatives, yeah. you know. Um how is this going to look? What does this look like? Is this going to be okay? Mm. Um, will anyone else I like need a, it? I need, yes. Will anybody yeah. else like this? Yeah. Where have I gone wrong? <laughs> mm. It's beautiful. But I... And I'm fussy. <laughs> you, I know you are. <laughs> you have a lot to teach me. <laughs> you really do. We teach each other. So we do. So oh my gosh, I'm so excited about yeah. some of the things that I have been learning already so from cool. Michelle. Nice. But isn't that incredible how this creative community um, has been joined together through, yeah. for example, IOD. Yeah. I, I love it that across, across yeah. the country, across the world, 
that we have can yep. connect in this creative way and learn from each other. Yeah. It's pretty it's amazing. It's like the, the vehicle or the glue that binds, you know? It's, um, it's really nice. Okay, fit right in there next to that Oh, Jeannie Henrik says, I love Toile and collected. I have researched many makers of old patterns. And this is such a fresh take on the classic. It's beautiful. Wonderful. Well, that's a nice, that's like a rubber stamp seal of approval, Jeannie. Hearing that. We are heavily into the birds and... Um, look chicken, at it. all feathery things here. You need to stand back and have a look, Lynn. Okay. Oh my. Happy? It now? is pretty. It's yeah. it's coming it's along. Balanced. It's coming along. It really is. Yeah. See what we're seeing. Okay. It's beautiful. You know, and again, I, I say that all the time that when you're Take a up step. close and looking at yeah. it, you're Be seeing awful. it. You, you, well, you're seeing it from a very different perspective than than from a distance, from ten feet away. Yeah. You know, I'm ten inches away, yeah. and I'm right on top of it, and I'm not really getting a good um, perspective representation yeah. of what the entire piece looks like. Yeah. So you really do have to. Oh. Boom, Tish. Catherine Mahone. <laughs> what? That's what you do with chickens. What is that? Wing it. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I love it. That's great. Very clever. Mm -hmm. Oh, Shirley knows that. Uh -huh. <laughs> is that going to fit just right there? Just keep turning it around and see the different... Why are you enjoying it? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's lovely, so Ooh. gorgeous. I'm literally like I'm sweating this one out. There are a few projects that I've done live like this. One of them being the ice skating Stamping dresser. Is always Stamping. Oh, well, oh yeah. my goodness. Yeah. It's like, like oh. to um Test yourself out with the most technically difficult on a lot. Don't, don't I always? Mm. Oh, my goodness. What am I it's thinking? It's like you're setting yourself up. Hello from Colorado. Hello. It's Laura from Colorado. Sorry, late, but it looks beautiful. Oh, yeah. you're excused for your tardiness. <laughs> That's nice. We've got 65 people. They'll pop in and out and... Yeah. We'll finish this up momentarily. Okay, I'm I'm liking. Yeah, do we like it? Yeah, so far. Um, I need an element right here. And what will it be? Will it be that bird? Will it be the bot the feet of a chicken? What do we think? I'm waiting. <laughs> <laughs> I'm waiting, Michelle. Yeah, I know. I would have gone this, but you've already gone that there already. So. What's that? I would have gone that, but you've already got that. And then if you put that, it's too much floral. It's too much floral. So, so we need another maybe, animal, maybe. I'm it's thinking. It's got to be another animal. I'm thinking an animal. What do you um, guys think? Kind of the way it's. How many of those birds on a branch have you done? Oh, there's so many. But how many have you done on there? We've done two. Well, so. I, well, you could throw another bird in and orientate it. This is our. This is the bird from there. So maybe. Yeah. Yep. Would and you then go up there? Else. Yeah. Yeah. I'm thinking. Mm -hmm. Okay. We're gonna do that. That's what we're gonna do. Because it's good to have the threes, the elements with the odd numbers, isn't mm -hmm. it? I think so. That bird. Everyone's saying bird. So bird, bird, bird. Good, good, good. Bird is the word.
Yeah. And you've only got some filling in. For and then I'm going to just do some bees. Yeah. Ooh. Come on. It's just such a pretty. It really ends up being a beautiful overall pattern, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Let me do some B action. And I think that that will also, that one repeating element throughout is going to um, unify everything as well. Right? Yeah. We need a few of these little guys. So we shall see. We're almost done. Almost. I like the idea of these little bees throughout because it fills in space. creates again um, a uniform pattern. Do you see any spots that I kind of want them going different ways? Yeah, I do, Corinne. Um... I don't, I haven't been teaching. I lack a lot of confidence in front of the camera. We're trying to change um, that. Yeah. Um, I, yeah, and I don't, I haven't got a website either, which needs to change because yep. I'm about to relocate my shop um, and I'm, it's half the size of my original shop that I've had for 15 years. Um, so it's 15 years worth of stuff. <laughs> Uh, so I need to get a website yeah. done a and I need yeah. to start sharing my tips and tricks and yes, you should. start sharing my techniques um, and things. I might have to bring in that, a smaller one. I might have to bring a smaller one. Thanks, Corinne. A bee on the bottom to the left of the small chicken, Mary Casey said. Yes, and you know what I'm going to do, Mary? I'm going to. Thanks, Mary. I need to choose a smaller bee. Yeah, because there's all different size bees on that one, on the birds and bees one. And I think that that'll be just the right size to yeah. fill in, you know, like here. Thanks. Yeah, Cindy, that's fine. Like, you know, everyone's got their own taste and their own opinions. It's good. But um, I would see it with just white table linen and white, simple white plates and cups. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't add too much pattern to it because it's the... Because there's already a lot it's going the, on. It's the yeah. star of the show. 
but you could also put a little supper cloth over that <clears throat> over that as well if you were serving if it was in use and you were serving it for a tea. A supper cloth. You oh like a yeah, like table a small, cloth? Yeah, but, that, okay. but it's a it's a specific short tablecloth. Okay. Like a small square. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And they call that a supper cloth in oh. Australia. It gets overlaid on the, on top of your normal tablecloth. Yep. So that's where you put your they're beautiful, they um mm -hmm. often had a lot of the embroidery mm -hmm. work. Oh how done they there. Hmm. You're getting there. Getting there. We're almost there, you guys. Almost there. Woo! I'm mm. gonna need a. Mhm. Mm just to. Yeah. Just to in there. Yeah. Pull out a bigger space. Spray. Yeah. Oh gosh. Okay. She's getting there, I'm getting Paula. There. I'm getting there. Yeah, the top left. She's not going to leave that blank. Oh no, no. Don't worry. No, no. <laughs> we won't do that. That would mess too much with all of our OCD. That would really throw us <laughs> off, wouldn't it? Yeah. We wouldn't be able to sleep tonight. Don't you worry, none of us. Oh, goodness. You know what would happen Could not to me? leave that. I would be back here painting yeah. over the whole thing and doing it all again tonight. That's what I would be doing. Mm -hmm. We're not going to do that. We you will not do that. You're going to need a few pineapple slices soaked in something. <laughs> After all Corinne. of this. Yes, I think so. <laughs> this is one I'm looking for. Yeah. That one. Yeah, that's it. Thanks, Cheryl. Beautiful. So there you go. I thought I had an easy solution worked out for repeating my patterns by laying them out with different thin mounts and then lo and behold, guess what? I decided that that just was not going to work for me. <laughs> the other thing, Cindy, I'll say too, is you're only, <clears throat> the way the camera is, you're only focused on the top of the table you're not seeing it as a hole in the shot at the moment so we might try and back it up a little bit and get you to then see it as a whole and you can see the design is just on the top but when you see the legs and base it looks quite nice as well i think you see that, guys? Wow. Yeah. It's actually quite pretty, mm -hmm. isn't it? Yeah. I think it needs some strawberries right there. Yeah. In that little space. So when Lynn does mm -hmm. that, and then I'll try and give you guys an overhead. I'll try and give you guys... Sorry, excuse all the wobble. Hope I don't make you sick. Um, I'll try and give you guys an overhead of a pan over the top to see it. All her hard work. Mary Casey says, I love that table. Thank you, Mary. And Angela Thomas says, it is truly gorgeous. And how brave is Lynn stamping on the tabletop with a slight wobble? <laughs> right? <I know. laughs> it's the floor that's not, it's not it's the table, the it's the floor. <laughs> and the old concrete floor. <laughs> Yeah, see, now I feel like, oh, that's too much in there. No, it's not. It's not? Stand okay. Back. Okay, it'll be okay. Yeah, yeah. it's fine. Yeah. All right. Mm. Again, I'm on top of yeah. it, yeah. so... No, it's fine. I'm Sorry. only seeing... Yeah, that's all he needs. A little something. Could it have been, maybe? No? No? It's good. Really good. See, that to me, that looks too busy up there. My eye is immediately going to go to that, and it's going to bother me. Only because you've got space still maybe over here. And then just, yeah. You know what I mean? This is too much. I feel like it's too much. Where? Right here. In it's too section. much. Mm-hmm. 
So it just needed to be a smaller spray mm -hmm. in rather than that. Oh boy. <laughs> She'll paint it. <laughs> You'll paint. But yeah, it's all good. Mm -hmm. It's all good. It is all good. Yeah. Because this is what we do. There's no harm done. What I could yeah. have done is it's just fun. masked off that little part one. of the yeah. strawberry yeah. as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and that's an option. Mm -hmm. But we've got no masking. We don't have the mask down here with us. I don't know. Well, you know, we I do? can tape it off even. Yeah, know? true. But you're kind of on a, you know, you're under pressure. You're on film. You're um, so you're on pressure. a time crunch. I know. I'm you know, fine. you can't think of everything. You're a human being. You're a, a human. A, you're a human being, as my beautiful grandson would say. So here's what I'm going to do, you guys, because... Oh, no. <laughs> Lord. <laughs> wow, I'm not going to do a Megan. <laughs> Is this making you anxious, Michelle? Oh, my goodness. Well, was it necessary? Yeah. Wow. It was necessary to me. Yeah. Cool. So... That's the way it is. Yeah. <laughs> Not as busy as once you see the bottom. I know. I know. That looks gorgeous. Not too much. Looks perfect, Penny Hogan's saying. Yeah. That one I thought it's too patty. I thought maybe take out the one. It's going the whole hog, guys. Going the whole hog. Sure. What, what was that, Shirley? Nothing unusual. No. Uh, Shirley, what do you say? You've seen it all. <laughs> Just about. <laughs> You've seen my ways. <laughs> yep. So, you're going to do like the desert rose thing there, Lynn, instead? Or, like, what are you thinking to go in its place? I'm thinking of bringing that down a little bit more. Obviously, you have a plan in mind. I do. I think I do. Mm. Okay. Yeah, Corinne. It's either wipe now or repaint at midnight, right? I can't. No. <laughs> it's got to do it now. A little smidge of it. Yeah. The perfectly imperfect was not perfect enough. See? Says Patty Hogan. That's exactly and right, Patty. Patty knows. Patty knows. It's so funny because when you when you are working with all of these different shapes and elements, and sometimes it does get down to like right to mm -hmm. this. We don't have the advantage. Like so, like what Sally and Josie shared on the IOD uh, page on Instagram showed a digital um, mock-up. And so they can shift those pieces and parts around without actually applying stamps and yeah. ink. <laughs> so um, so we, we don't have the luxury of doing that on a real piece. And so, but what we do, what we can do is... We can, we can um, come back and fix. And I find it especially um, easy to do when you're working with DIY paint and these stamps. That's right, Jeannie. Don't want any eye twitches. Yeah. It is an important part of the pattern. So I'm just thinking if I brought this... But that, see, then that's yeah. going to interfere. Yeah, you need the But I might bring, I might bring that down a little. Hmm. I got to think through it. Look at your options. Give me. Okay, you're right. You're right. right. Look at my options. Look, you've got that one. That's. And what's is that desert rose one you said, Shirley? It was like a desert rose, wasn't it? This one is just about the perfect fit right here, and then I can put a little bee right there, right? That's right. Ready? That's yeah. right. Right. <laughs> I don't know what I'm agreeing to, but I'm agreeing. 
Lynn. That's right, Lynn. There we go. Wow, Mary. That's really high tech. What'd she say? Mary um, sometimes photocopies her stamps and makes a layout on her computer. Oh, Mary. Mary, that Mary is so clever. Mary. You're a genius. <laughs> Love it. I know. <laughs> but it's what just how you idea. approach it. She does the pre-planning. Mary's doing unlike, so then we don't have to come back and unlike the one who's winging it yeah. right yeah. Unlike, unlike the, the one who's winging it. It. Yeah. Yeah. I'm always yes like the longest way around things that'll be me Mary that is actually a great very idea. clever it's such a good idea super clever so he, off the packet or how's Mary tackling that? Well, I'm sure she's making, for example, she may phone, oh, she may take a picture take a, do and then a take stand. the little bits oh. in apart um, digitally. Right, Mary? And or then she actually, can rearrange them. Yeah. Are you actually stamping it and then taking an image of the stamp? Yeah. So one yeah. time, many years ago, with a new IOD release... I did some. I did a digital mock-up. Oh. And I shared it in the stockist group and caused quite a stir because... They liked it? Or it was controversial? How did she get those things ahead of time? And, uh, you know, how did she get those stamps ahead of time and all of that? And what I did is I you took one of hard. the early, one of the images that Josie and Sha Sally had shared with us and oh, I made just a kind of broke it apart. Yeah. I didn't share it publicly. I just shared it in the stockist yeah, group. Yeah. And I sure. wanted that background so that then I could yeah. feature some of the new typography stamps within that. So you had the jump star I did. on the planning. Of the planning of your part of it. Yeah, yes. it part of your, and you were being kind by sharing the creative, what you discovered mm -hmm. that you could do. Yes. And that was a backlash. <laughs> a little bit, but... You live with it. But I think it was just not understanding, like, what I had done or what I... Yeah, yeah. Where you were going with it. Yeah. How I had achieved that yeah. look. And, of course, we use digital mock-ups all the time. Yeah. You know? Josie and Sarah. Every release, them. they um, do. Yeah. Yeah. The, uh, they're like an overlay on a photo. Right, Amazing. Right. And it's fun to do that. And um, I'd like to know how they did it on with. Um, I can never think of his name. Birds transfer. I just did. Beautiful bungalow. Oh my goodness. What I want to know is how they did it on the overlay, <coughs> the impression on um, Bungalow on that sideboard, the teal and green sideboard. It's really that was quite incredible. easy if you have, um, you know, if, if you have a little bit of um, ability in the area of, um, you know, just. You photo, probably need to have the Photoshop. Pro yeah, you or, need to have the program. The hard you know, one. anything like that. You, you can. I'm looking for that bee that I have. Uh, hold on. The smaller one. Where did I put him? Bee's not behaving. A bee is not behaving. And we can't. Oh, have... you take an image of the stamp carrier sheet, Mary. Yes. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. And then you can, again, using a, a type of a digital program, you're able to kind of piece those things apart. Oh, it's frozen. Oh, yeah, we're On probably it. done anyway. Yeah, okay. It's but low battery. That's There's that. battery issue. Oh, that's oh. okay. So we will... Uh, Are we still there, guys? Yeah, we froze for just a second. 
So we are just about finished anyway. We have gone way longer than I had expected. But um, I'll just give them a little aerial. Would you like a little peek, guys, of how it looks from above? About the rooster tail. Not sure. How do you think? I think it's good. Good. Now it's time to stop. Well, yeah. almost. Yeah. Almost. Is good. That's the best I can do, guys. I like it. All right. I think I'm done. I think I'm done. I think we have come to that moment where I need to not touch it anymore, other than right there. But um, there it is. I think that's that's it. Yeah. And boy, do I have a lot of stamps laying around. You guys, you've been so patient today to hang in here with us. Um, but you know, I can see already that is like nervous as I was about how this was all going to come together. I. Even stepping back this little bit, now that I have filled in the spaces, I like it. Good. I like it. I think it's going to be really good. So thanks, you guys. Um, we'll see you Friday upstairs. Again, thank you so much for hanging in there with me. Don't forget um, that we are here Thursday through Sunday at our brick and mortar. And uh, if you are would be so kind, we'd love it if you would subscribe, leave us a comment or a thumbs up so that uh, we can help to reach that 15,000 subscriber mark. Bye guys. Bye.